As you hold each other's hands, I invite you to take note of those hands that you hold, for they are the hands of the person with whom you'll spend the rest of your life. The hands that will help to celebrate life's joys and will wipe away the tears in the times of life's sorrows. They are the hands that will accompany you when things are good, the hands that will support you in times of difficulty. Those are the hands that you reach for today and that I invite you to reach for tomorrow and the next day and every day. For in the holding of those hands firmly, you celebrate that you share with each other your lives. And this is the person with whom you will spend the rest of your life. It is a wonderful thing that family and friends are here. They have hands, those hands which reach forward to you in the days ahead to support you in this great step you make towards each other. Those hands are the hands that support you and offer help. And it is not therefore to be taken as weakness to reach to those hands that also serve to help you in your marriage. I, Gary, thank you, Glenny, to be my wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or worse, richer or poorer, sickness and health, love and cherish, till death do us part. I, Glenick, take you, Gary, to be my husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or worse, for richer or poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death do us part. By the authority committed to me, I now declare that your husband and wife, in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Guess what, sir? You get to kiss your bride. Yeah.